raise your drinks up casually. Raise your drinks, raise your drinks up, raise your drinks up casually. It's the Black Bourbon Family. Hey everyone, I'm Jason. And I'm Brandy. And we're the Black, Black Bourbon, Bourbon Family. Family. We're coming in hot with a hot one today. A hot one. Hot one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, we got Four Roses Small Batch Limited Edition 2021, 2021. release. <laughs> <laughs> A hot one, Brandon. Hot one. It's 114.2 proof. Okay, a point two. With the MSRP of $150. Secondary. Just guess. <laughs> <laughs> so um yeah, Jason was able to find another special bottle. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. All right, y'all. So, the Four Roses Limited Edition. So, this one is very special, right? Comes out once a year. This is the highly allocated bourbon that if you find it or if you have an opportunity at a reasonable price, get it. It's known to have just great uh, age to it. So this one has a 16 year old. So for those who don't know, Four Roses have these four letter codes is what I'll call them. They're recipes rather. And they mean a bunch of different things. I don't have all that information, but I'm going to tell you what's in it. And I'll put it on the screen and you can uh, look the specifics of the <laughs> recipes up. So, coming in first, you have a 16-year-old OESV. So, I heard that the, this uh, recipe is in most of the single barrels. Next, you have a 12-year-old OESK. So, that's the second recipe. The next one is a 14-year-old. 14 years. O B S Q. So this Q strand is I've heard it hasn't been in uh, some of the recent limited editions. So this is back in, you know. And then the last one is another 16 year old O B S V. So if y'all figure out all them letters. <laughs> <laughs> He's supposed to be telling y'all, right? Right. <laughs> <laughs> Giving you homework. <laughs> I'm going to put it on the screen. And maybe I'll, for each one of them, I'll give a brief description of what that means. Maybe. <laughs> no. <laughs> Stop holding to it. <laughs> but no, so you have 16-year-old bourbon in here. And the youngest is 12. So from a, like, a bourbon stated a statement perspective they would have to say it's a 12 year old bourbon because that's the youngest bourbon mm. in the uh in the mix if you will okay and the um what you got blend in the blend but yeah so before we get started give us a thumbs up subscribe to the channel turn your notifications on if you haven't already and tell your friends tell your friends about us tell them tell everybody <laughs> 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 and you know what Brandy I know we hadn't mentioned this but I'm just going to say it for our Patreon members we are going to do a what do you call that randomizer put your names in the hat see who gets a sample of the Four Roses limited edition oh wow Yep. so stay tuned uh, Patreon members you have a chance and for those who haven't consider joining us on Patreon and I have a cigar pairing too for everyone. Okay. All right. All right. Here we go. You ready? I'm ready. Ooh, nice caramel amber color mm -hmm. going on here. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm. Smells mm. good. <laughs> Ooh, smell like some chocolate. Mm hmm. Mm. Got a little spice in there. 
because I think one of those uh, recipes is like a high rye mash bill. So you can smell that spice from the rye. Maybe Jason can eat this or drink this with the <laughs> chocolate cake I made for my son the other oh, day. Oh, yeah. He told me to keep it out the house. Mm. <laughs> chocolate cake, boy, I'll tear it up. Um, Anything sweet. But anyway, yeah. this does have that chocolatey smell to it. Yeah. It have that spice to it. Uh, you ready? Go. Cheers. cheers. <laughs> Mm. So, this is what I like. Rich. Mm -hmm. It's, you know, got that thickness mm -hmm. and the sweetness. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. So, this is the highest proof that this has been, too. The 114 that you mentioned, this is the highest proof. This is good, Brandy. Like the legs, it has some nice legs on it. It has that thickness to it, right? It tastes some blueberries. Blueberries. Oh, Lord. She got blueberries, y'all. Mm. I'm sorry. You was talking about the legs. Uh-uh. It's okay. So, I got some caramel, vanilla, some oakiness to it. Because I, I can taste a little bit of the... Uh, it's not dry. But it's, you know, you got a little bit of that oak, that spicy oak kind of taste to mm -hmm. it. A little pepper. Nice finish. It's good stuff here. It's good. This is good. This is good. This is good. Anything else you get on it? Ooh. <laughs> I mean, it's definitely spicy. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But like you said, it, it doesn't have like that Kentucky hug. It's mm -hmm. just it's just like a, a peppery, like a black pepper yeah. spice. It's not like a cinnamon spice. Mm -hmm. It's more um, peppery. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But it's it's good. But it's it counteracts with the the sweetness. The sweetness, right? So it's a, a nice balanced bourbon. <clears throat> it's very good. I mean. Yeah, it's it's that well-rounded thing. And that's the thing I like, you know, the get all the different flavors to it. And it's not overly <clears throat> sweet either. Mm -mm. It has that richness that I like, mm -hmm. but it's not like an overly sweet bourbon either. Yeah. And I and I like sweet, but this is, you know, just, just right. Yeah, I mean, it hits all the right notes. It really does. And like you said, too, it's like rich. It has that, that thickness to it. Mm -hmm. Nice finish, good mouthfeel. This, yes. Four Roses, you've done it again. Ooh, that pepper boy. <laughs> <laughs> no, this is, you see on that one, I got a nice sweet note to it. And it was almost, I want to, I've been getting a lot of strawberry lately. Okay. When I taste different things. Mm -hmm. I wanted to say a strawberry again with that one. So, no, this, you all, if you have an opportunity, I would definitely say pick it up. It's, it's well worth the cost. And, you know, think about the age of the bourbon in here. You got six, two 16-year-old recipes, one 14 and one 12. So, that's some good age. <laughs> she just tasting this. She's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever you say, Whatever Jason. Whatever you say, Jason. This stuff is good. <laughs> So for my cigar smokers, I felt like a good limited edition bourbon should have a good cigar to go with it. So I have the God of Fire Siri B. This is, these are aged cigars. So this one specifically is a 2018. It has a um, Ecuadorian sun-grown wrapper. I always get the Equ so many Ecuadorian this or whatever. <laughs> so this is Ecuadorian sun-grown wrapper with Dominican binders and fillers. The taste matches the chocolatey taste of the Four Roses. It's some chocolate. It's some black pepper. It's it's, to me, this is a good balance between those sweeter notes 
and those spicy notes. So that's why I felt like when we had a quick sip of this before, I felt like this would be a good pairing for this bourbon. Man. <laughs> <laughs> I think... Um, He's gonna hurry up and pour that sample for the Patreon. Right. <laughs> And so for my Patreon members, we will, um, you know, for those who want to join, I think we're going to do it in about a week, you know, give folks, if some new folks want to join, uh, we give them an opportunity. But this is something that we're going to start doing on a monthly basis with the different reviews that we do. We're going to give a sample out of uh, one of the bottles and this one will be for this month. But yeah, I think this may uh, give... Bowman a good run for his money. I mean, Bowman is good though. I yeah. mean, this, you know, Bowman is still <laughs> <Look>. a good one. <laughs> it's good, but but yeah, that Bowman is good. Yeah, that Bowman is really, really good. Yeah. All right, y'all. Well, we thank you for joining us. Uh, as as mentioned earlier, give us a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, turn on your notifications. And we will see you next time. Cheers.